Hangout apps let you add new functionality to your Hangout sessions. There are some apps installed by default and they are usually located on the left side of the window. Let's take a quick look at what's there. This first application here lets you open up a chat window. Some things can be easier to communicate in a written form, like web addresses for example. The second one here lets you share your screen with others. You can now work normally on your computer and let others see and comment on what you are doing. This is very handy for all sorts of situations like troubleshooting software problems and collaborating on different creative projects. The camera application here simply lets you take still pictures. The YouTube app is for sharing YouTube videos between the participants. Everyone will see and hear the same videos in sync. We have a Google Drive app which lets us collaborate on documents while in the Hangout. And yes, there are even silly effects when you need a bit of fun in your life. These were only some default apps. You can install new ones from here. There are many different types of apps available. Hangout Toolbox brings you options like lower thirds and fast audio level control to your Hangouts. There's even an app called Soundation that lets you create music together with others. Feel free to experiment with all the different apps in order to enhance your Hangouts. That wraps up this Hangout app tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.